horrible today. Is Yellowstone about to erupt? Questions are rising after this morning's hydrothermal eruption. A small hydrothermal explosion occurred at the Biscuit Basin Thermal Area in Yellowstone National Park this morning, at 10 a.m. Mountain Standard Time, a little over two miles from Old Faithful. Many videos have been shared showing the incident, and although the sidewalk was damaged, no one was hurt. Unusual activity at a supervolcano like this can raise concerns about its stability, but are you right to be concerned? The Yellowstone caldera last erupted 70,000 years ago, with enough force to eject more than 240 cubic miles of volcanic material. Media reports often claim that Yellowstone is about to erupt now, but that's not necessarily the case. Michael Poland, a geophysicist and the scientist in charge of the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory, told Live Science last year that this is probably the most common misconception about Yellowstone, and about volcanoes in general. Volcanoes don't work on a timeline. A volcano erupts when there is enough magma below the surface to erupt, and the pressure causes that magma to rise. There is no single condition that is happening at Yellowstone right now, he said. It all depends on the magma supply. This morning's eruption is known as a hydrothermal eruption. These eruptions occur when water suddenly turns to steam while underground and are actually quite common in Yellowstone, and have nothing to do with magma rising to the surface. This eruption occurred on April 15, 2024, and a very similar eruption occurred at the same location on May 17, 2009. Monitoring data shows that the Yellowstone area is not changing. Today's eruption does not reflect any activity in the volcanic system, the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory YVO, said in its Yellowstone Volcano Notification Service. While today's eruption was dangerous enough for close observers, YVO stressed that there is still no existential danger coming from Yellowstone and that it remains at a normal, alert level.